Hey guys, Donna here. Hope you're doing well on a very casual Monday. Very casual today. <laughs> so what I want to talk to you today about is the fact that you don't need as many clients as you probably think you do. One of the activities that I do with all of my mentorees is calculate and reverse engineer how many clients they need. And we always start off with what is their income goal um, and we discuss how many clients they can actually support in a comfortable way, um, meaning without necessarily getting lots and lots of subcontractors or without working crazy number of hours because we're all about having a part-time business with a consultant style income. And, um, and once we do all these calculations and we work it out, often we don't need as many clients as we think we do. Often it's only between five and maybe even 10 clients, which sounds like a lot, but it actually isn't a lot if you think about the millions and millions of small businesses out there in the world. And all you need to get is, say, five clients to meet your income goal. It really removes a, sh a lot of the overwhelm about building your business because when you realize that there's millions of, of uh, potential clients out there and you only need five, it's not that hard. Now, the way that this can happen is because of packaging. Now, I talk about packaging all the time, but one of the powerful um, results of packaging is the fact that we need less clients to meet our income goals and to achieve everything that we want to achieve in our business. Um, we, we're able to um, plan better. We're able to finance our lifestyle better. We're able to have less stress. We're able to have a more balanced life because we're working less hours. We have more time with our family, etc., etc. And this is possible because of packaging. So if you're sitting there thinking, oh, right, wow, I really want to make $100,000 a year, but that would mean I need 30 clients giving me these number of hours a week. Um, and I don't know how I'm going to cope with 30 clients. So then I need to get a, two subcontractors to manage the workload. But if I have two subcontractors, that means my profit drops. So I need to actually get 40 new clients to still meet the income goals. And if all these numbers are going around in your head and you're thinking, this is just not possible, not in a stressless way. I'm here to tell you that you actually probably don't need as many as you think if you just change the way you price yourself and the way that you change people to perceive how you are so they are prepared to invest more in with you. So that's my quick little video today. You're just getting back into the groove after being un so unwell for so long. I mean, oh, my skin is showing it. Ugh. Um, and lack of sleep. <laughs> but I just wanted to share that with you because it was a really important epiphany for one of my recent mentorees and I wanted to share it with you today. So I hope you're having an awesome day. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time. Bye.